Hey, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show how to create a day to night cycle. So first I will open a basic map here. Uh, so just I will go to this first person shooter map and double click on this map here. So literally the final output I will show in this map. So just I will double click. And after opening this level, uh, we need to go to this outliner and we need to select this directional light. Uh, so in this directional light, we need to go to this details panel. And here the mobility, we have to set it to like mobile. So as we are doing the day to night cycles, so we need to move the light source from one position to another position. So in order to do that, we need to set this option to like mobile. So default light will be like stationary. So you have to set it to like mobile. And after that, we need to open a level blueprint. So in order to open that, we need to go to this option and just we have to select this open level blueprint. And now here, first we need to create a variable. So here you can see there is a variable and we need to click on this add and just you can give any name. So whatever. So like I will give like sun speed and here I will change the type of the variable to float. So why is this? Because we will define the sun speed by using this variable here. So just we need to drag this into the blueprint and just we need to select this get, get sun speed. And now we need to take another node. So event tick. So just we need to select this and take a multiply node from this event tick. So just we need to drag this and we need to take a multiply node. So select this. And now we need to connect this on speed to here. So just we need to select and drag here. And see now whenever we select uh, here, we are getting the sun speed option and also make sure you have to compile this. So just let us let us compile. And now here you can define the sun speed. So for time being, I will put it to like 10 or something. So we need to take another node. So just we will drag from here and we'll take a node called make rotator. So just we'll select this. And now we want to rotate the sun in the y axis. So we need to select the, uh, we need to change this connection to the y axis. So in order to disconnect, just we need to out left click and we can drag from here. To the y axis and now we need to bring the directional light to in this blueprint here so in order to do that we need to go to this like outliner and make sure we need to select the directional light and we need to press tab here so create a reference to the directional light so need we need to select this here and now we need to get the local rotation of this light here so in order to do that we need to take one node so just i will drag here and create a node called add actor local rotation and now what the thing is uh, from this make rotator, we need to connect this, uh, connect to this node here. So just we'll select this and we'll connect to this delta rotation. And now we need to execute this. So in order to do that, just we need to drag this execute from event tick to add actor local rotation. So drag this and once compile this and let us check this. And also make sure you have to give the sun speed here. So as we are given the 10 and now we'll close this and now we'll play this. And now you can see, so see now the sun direction is changing. So we'll decrease the speed of the sun here and we can select this and just we can change it to like two or something and just make sure you have to compile this and close. And now we need to click on this play again. So now see it's slowly changing the directions of the sun here. And now we'll see this effect in another level. So here we will click on play. So just I will click on play. So that's it for this tutorial. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.